What's happening guys? Master Smiley here. Today I'm gonna post this video on how to practice and keep your KD up and keep you on your toes, on your aiming, your response time. And how I like to do that is I like to go to the multiplayer option and then go down to the local play and just join game as, as normal and then you got all these options here and uh, I usually go to game setup and there's different ways As you see I already have this one set up for uh, free for all but you can change like the maps default maps here that you can choose from or bonus maps when the new maps come out for Call of Duty Advanced Warfare which is what I'm playing right now and if you barely got the game and you want to go online and you want to keep your KD up and before you get into the battlefield with other players you know this is a good idea to go to your local play and take on the bots you know these bots are no joke they really can show you what they can do and as you'll see here but here's the other mode you can change the map as I did and there's modes or standard modes it's just like online play you got the same option as online play free for all team deathmatch so on bonus modes infected esports you know same I guess this is competition series here classic modes recent modes you know whatever you play whatever you play the most I guess so I just go into standard mode, I'm in free for all, and I, I'm i going to choose a map here, like we'll do the terrace map. I just use the options on default, but bots I put and max it out to 11, and there's different difficulties, you start on regular, there's recruit which is like easy, mix is all mix, basically it's like playing online. But I usually go straight to the veteran. That they they do a lot of different style moves and stuff. They'll show you what you can do. So here we go, gameplay. And obviously this is Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. And this is a good tip I like to do. I usually when I before I play a game, before I go online, this is what I usually go to, local play veteran that way I get to know the maps I get to know the layouts I get to know I mean, maybe you can figure out the spawn points plus you can work on the agilities and here you got the same loadout options the game the, the guns here are not what I have the defaults is different these are the ones I choose so uh, I'll we'll try Free this throw. Get out there and earn your paychecks. And this is just like online play. This is just exactly if you don't have an internet connection, you want to play some multiplayer. Always good to go on local play and you'll get that multiplayer experience. They're just as good as playing online, you probably better. They can really move around, they can really show you what your character or what your soldier is capable of doing. Plus, you know, you, you can practice your agilities. Jump from side to side. Get on buildings. So it's a pretty good practice tool, I think. Plus it doesn't affect your KD or anything like that. This is basically, for me, it's a tool to get myself ready. Before I go online. And I say these bots are a lot. A lot harder than playing the people online because a lot of people online don't really know how to 
move around with all these new jumping techniques, boosting, boosters and stuff like that, jetpacks. So this will give you a heads up. Or sometimes you know you can set it to easy, set it to the recruit. Practice your guns, you know, your quick scoping, your quick draw, you can test your weapons out. What's really fun to do too is if you put it on veteran and you go one on one with the bots. Now that some that's challenging. Enemy UAV above. You win sometimes and sometimes you lose. It's actually pretty easy. And surprisingly these bots they can't I mean they, they're really precise, they don't mess around, their their aim is right on. No matter what you're doing, if you're jumping from side to side and whatnot, their aim is right on. So I, I, I'm just, you know, this is what I usually do. This is practice. Like. Enemy UAV online. I really love this new jumping technique they have on here. Brings a whole new perspective to the game. I don't know if any of you have ever played Unreal Tournament 3, you know, or Halo. I'm sure you can play Halo. But more of a, this game reminds me more of a Unreal Tournament 3. The jumping feel, the dashing side to side and dashing forwards and Enemy backwards. UAV online. That's what this reminds me of a lot. It's, it's pretty neat. So right off, when I first started playing this game, I kind of already knew. Like, wow, you know, this is all so familiar to me. Because I used to play the Unreal Tournament on the PlayStation 3 online. And I was, I was okay too, you know. Had an IKD, get monster kills, make kills. So this is kind of the same feel. I don't see much videos like this out there too. Uh, using local play and taking on bots and stuff. So I figure I'd make this video for you guys. For some of you noobs out there, new players that want to start off good and want to start off with a good, decent KD. It's the best way to do it. Ghost is the best too when you do that on Ghost. Ghost will teach you how to quick scope, drop shots, stuff like that. So, basically, yeah, this is what this is. This is just a practice tool that I want to show you guys using the local play on the multiplayer and it will it really will help you and again these bots are no joke man they'll take you down so i'm master smiley i hope this video helps you out and like subscribe and good luck out there in advanced warfare call of duty game on people later